Hey guys, we're watching the Netflix Avatar The Last Airbender live action series. And if you want us to watch the rest of this show, get this video to 15,000 likes. Head over to patreon.com slash spilling the milk to watch the full version of this video, the uncut commentary, subscribe. Also, we're doing a series where we're reacting to the cartoon right now. There are five parts out, so go subscribe to our Patreon and you can watch them. I haven't seen anything of the show yet. I guarantee you more than half of the show takes place indoors or at night. It's live action CGI. Like they wanted to disguise how bad this earth bending looks in this first scene. So they're just gonna, so you have to squint to see any of the characters. Stop! Fire, oh my God. Rawr! Wait, is that rock bending? Oh my God. Either that or he shit himself. This doesn't look bad, bro. This looks all right. I don't know what I'm looking at, though. It's really dark. I don't know what's going on. Just put the brightness up. <laughs> Yo, editor, help us out here. It's very interesting because when you see the ground type in live action, you can almost see the shit texture of the land. And he's making like a very constipated expression. He's, like, he's basically shit bending. Get that to the Earth King. They're going to start a war. They're going to start a war. You have one guy. One guy said they were starting a war and this spread a rumor. It's mass hysteria. This is like when I read like a misinformation in a Twitch chat and I would just believe it. All eyes will be on the Earth Kingdom. All eyes but ours. Who's this guy? Santa Claus? Holy shit. They have Asian Santa Claus in this show? It is our time. He's so crispy looking. The firebenders are the greatest chefs and that's why they took over the world is because they made they made the optimal McDonald's and that like kind of like capitalized on every city. Water. Oh my God, get the shit out of my face. Get this fucking dog shit out of my face. <laughs> this looks AI, I, sorry, sorry, it looks AI. This is giving Sora AI. The one person with the ability to master all four elements. This is like full animation. So where's the live action? Why are we watching animation? The new incarnation has yet to emerge. And so. And I believe that we can make this intro much longer. Why is it fucking longer? May not be ready for the responsibility of becoming the avatar with the responsibility of becoming the avatar that's what it got changed to let's take the fucking intro and make it not epic the yapatar bro the <laughs> Is that another flashback? Bro, can we fuck off with the fucking flashback? Can we just start the goddamn show the way God intended? <laughs> Look at him. Look at his eyebrows. But there's lighting, bro. Like, we can see. It's daytime. Isn't that crazy? Dude, the fucking Marvels looked better than this shit, dude. <laughs> Stop! Stop! Why is he flying like this? The Marvels costed, like, so much money. Whoa! I thought a Blitzkrieg was about to come, bro. Holy shit. I thought they were about to die. They look so dirty. Well, I guess they would be, actually. Wait up. All those other kids that are bald and short could have played Ong, but they didn't get the role, so now they have to play backup Ong. That's tough. I would hate being an understudy Ong. We need to help them as well. And we need the Avatar. The appeal of Avatar, the appeal of One Piece. These are adventure series. Why the fuck do you start your show off with so much political dialogue? We're supposed to find out all this stuff naturally by exploring. If we were gonna extend the backstory, the only thing I wanna see is more of Gyato's fat ass. You know what I'm saying? We don't get to see enough of that. I'm ex that's the only thing I'm excited for in this live action. Why do I have to be different? This kid's a pretty good actor. I'd say his performance so far is pretty good. For a child, yeah, he's passable. Couldn't sleep either, huh? Appa's fucking gross. Oh, he's disgusting. Give blood a shower, bro. What the hell? Brothers and sisters, we're under attack! Can we see every single air nomad being genocided? I hope they do that. Well, it's like they're really easy to spot because they've just got an arrow pointing right at them. Yeah, what the fuck is that? Like, hit me in my face, bro. Like, what is that? When they kill people in this show, they fucking kill them, bro. These firebenders are burning people to death. It's actually kind of fucking awesome. They are not fucking around. Isn't that crazy how, like, with the woman, like, okay, you don't have to be bald, but we're gonna fuck up your hairline. If I was a woman airbender, I would just go full bald. Like, what the hell is that? 
Gyatso! That was not Gyatso. That was the asshole from the council. I'm happy he's dead. He was mean to Aang. Dude, what particle effects, like, packages they download? I gotta get that shit. Not to be that guy, but if this creature can fly, why the fuck is he choosing to fly directly on the waves? Cuz he a fat ass, bro. He just went to Popeyes. <laughs> They're gonna kill all of them. The men, the women, and the younglings, too. No, not the younglings. It really does give prequel. Wait, the Avatar state. Comments are gonna kill us for like pronouncing it this way. Holy shit. The Ong Avatar. She's gonna be a good massage artist, bro. I'm not gonna cap. Me pondering my orb at 3 a.m. Be like. You know they actually went to Antarctica to film this? You know like 16 extras died of <laughs> hypothermia in the production of this? They didn't have any medics on set. We've been manning the wall in three hour shifts, but it seems some of you can't be trusted to stay at your post. And also, I love women. Can you say this after like every sentence? Like, no. They did that scene before in Avatar, except there was one really, really ugly kid I distinctly remember. Our way of life. Keeping it alive is our duty. Keeping ourselves alive is our duty. Sokka actor, low key good. Sokka's good, and then Katara. Katara, we'll see what happens. Some scenes look like Shark Boy and Lava Girl. Okay, don't don't be that rude to the show already, okay? It doesn't look that bad. I was thinking it though. Huh. Weird. Oh my god, she's drawn to it because she likes pondering her orb and she's like, this is an even bigger orb. She can have so many thoughts in that orb. His burn doesn't even look like a burn, it looks like makeup. Doesn't it look like he put blush on his eye? It's just a new fashion trend. Am I wrong or is Zuko's head too big? He has a giant head. Holy shit. They should have shrunk his head in post. Shut up with this epic music. He's a fucking 12 year old. My name is Ong. I'm the Ong Vatar. It can't be. What is it, Grand Grand? This is an airbender. So far, this is like leagues better than the One Piece live action. Like, I'm, I hate to say it. What? I think this is worse. I can't make that decision yet. You think we'll find the Avatar? Yes. Because of the light. Oh, Iroh. He's fat again. Yo, Iroh looks cool, though. Iroh looks cool as hell right now. My father has banished me until I find the Avatar. My father? My father was a Funko Pop. Like, shut the fuck up, bro. Dude, me having a dream, like what? What is Aang doing? Oh, Aang's literally having a dream. He's gonna fall in the water. Oh my God. What did the guy from Spilling the Book say about me? What the fuck? The anime? I'm not the anime. It sounded like you said, I'm not the anime. I'm Aang. I'm not the anime. Didn't you know Avatar's a Western production? That's not strange at all. Never mind. What did they do to him? He's hitting that shit though. Why does he look so stupid? Sky bison. Dude, people are gonna like this show solely because of Aang. Like, the actor for Aang is, like, I think he's doing him pretty decent. He's giving charming boy energy. The weather went crazy just after I left home. The Southern Near Temple. Oh, sorry, old lady jump scare. That was just a normal old lady. I didn't want to see that. Sorry. Bro got jump scared by his grandma. Water, earth, fire, air. Not this shit again, bro. Oh my fucking god, we just heard it, you old bitch! Why is she saying it? Only the Avatar, master of all four elements, could stop them. Why are you saying the intro? This is dumb. Like, they're just letting her yap. Bro, we've seen the show. You don't have to say the fucking intro. Where's the comedy, bro? Like, Avatar's a funny show. Like, consistently, it's full of jokes and slapstick. I literally don't feel like there's been almost a single joke yet. Like, I felt pretty similarly with the One Piece live action. Like, they sucked, like, so much of the comedy out of it. But I feel like so much of that comes out because of it being animated in a cartoon. They just don't think they could make the comedy work in live action when I'm like, comedy also exists in fucking live Live action. You don't have to make it Game of Thrones. Are you okay? 
I'm not okay. I'm sitting and pondering on top of a roof right now. Do I look like I'm okay? Do you need an orb? Um, <laughs> <laughs> I've got several orbs that I haven't used in eons. I had friends in the Fire Nation. I used to visit them. No one visits other nations now. Everyone's racist now. It's been 100 years and everyone's racist. Oh my god, that's Firebender. That's one big canoe. That is destroying the ozone layer. You see the fucking smoke coming out of that ship, bro? That's like a diesel engine. Sokka, the racks get them loaded. That kid looked like the guy from Ted. You know, uh, John? <laughs> <laughs> what if John played Sokka and he still had a Boston accent? That would be an amazing character. Also, isn't it weird that there's like another kid in the tribe that's like the exact same age as them, basically? Like, wasn't the whole point that they were like older than all the other kids and then everybody else was old? That's a very, very good point. <laughs> that's <laughs> such a good <laughs> point. That's such a good point. Oh, this kid's gonna die though. Oh my God, they're gonna kill him. They should kill him. Someone who is not one of you. Turn him over now. I do like yet a little bit of a voice crack on that. Turn him over now. You can't do this. You can't give him to He them. doesn't belong here. Not the shaky camera, bro. Jim Halpert is fucking holding the camera right now. <laughs> I just want to imagine they improvise him like walking around. The cameraman was like, oh shit, I gotta catch up. Where is he going? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, fighting in the day. Leave him alone! <laughs> it's the theme! They're playing his theme! I'll go with you. Just leave him alone. I'm the one you're looking for. He looks so funny. His ears are huge. Just like Aang's. That's what makes him perfect. Yeah. I think you're the bravest person I've ever met. What? Why are they gassing him up so much, bro? Stop gassing up Sokka. Stop gassing up Sokka. You're supposed to shit on Sokka. You're a cringe lord, Sokka. His entire people got genocided. And he's like, yeah, Sokka, your face got a little dirty. You're the bravest person I've ever met. I don't even fucking like Avatar, the actual show that much, but I can't even fucking watch this because of how insulting it is to the original show. I can't fucking watch this anymore, dude. Oh my god. Why is Iroh not smiling? Iroh's too serious. The fun of Iroh is that he holds back his emotions and there's a lot going on up there that he doesn't reveal. It makes him such an interesting character. Like he, he's what brings the comedy to that side of the story. He's like the dude that you think is a stoner, but then it's like, he's actually just like that. I kind of feel like they should have casted a comedian to play Uncle Iroh. But in the end, for most of us, it doesn't matter how this war started. It only matters how it can end. Well, it only matters how it can end. Let's skip to the last episode. He just, he just told us like it's all, the ending's the only thing that's important. NPC ass motherfucker right there. <laughs> I love the Hitman NPCs are awesome. Like they're just like, oh, did I hear a sound? Oh. It won't be easy to catch them. I know. Hopefully you can find a swift current. Maybe draft off their wake. Or 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 or, 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 or the seals. They cut out the penguin scene in the original, bro. Bro, imagine how bad the penguin scene would have looked oh, in know. this realization. This dude sucks at art, holy shit. That is yikes, dude. Bad drawing. Just improve your art, man. It'll just happen naturally, you know what I mean? It is kind of funny how quickly he escaped. Like they locked him up, then left instantly, and he escaped like two seconds after. Like he was in jail for like 30 seconds total. That looks so stupid. Wait, do you guys think Appa's gonna save him? No. Play the Gwen clip. Yo, the music's kind of good. It's like epic movie versions of tracks from the original show. What? She could do that now? Remember when Aang told her to just stop pondering and start pandering? We're pandering to the Game of Thrones audience. She doesn't look that excited. She's like, eh. It's cool, I guess. I mean, just a little thing. It's only the thing I've wanted to do my whole life. Yeah, it's not that cool. It's not that fucking cool. Be more excited! But time we show those flame heads, they can't just step all over us. <laughs> Aang laughed at that. It was like the laugh you give when someone says a joke and you, like, it's not funny at all, but you want to, like, respond in some way. 
Wait, they're already here? What the fuck is the pacing of this fucking show? No, they're not here. They're not here yet. They're not here yet. It's gonna be other people who are here. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, please show. Please prove him wrong. Thank you, Netflix. Thank you, Netflix. Dude, this place is not nearly overgrown enough. This shit looks like it happened last week. It's like they forgot to water the plants or some shit. <laughs> like, that's what it looks like. Yes, so now we rush through a scene where we get his reaction. So then it has way less weight because we just had to put it right at the beginning of the series with other flashback related stuff to just make it feel longer and less rewarding. Me, 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 me. Let's know. Dude, they he turned into a spirit Halloween skeleton, dude. No way. Oh my god. This is giving, like, Ryan Higa avatar in real life. <laughs> I can't imagine a better person to have been given this power. Do we somehow have less emotional attachment to Gyatso? And he has had way more screen time. Oh my god, it looks like the Flash. Oh, it does, oh it does, my it god, does. Oh my god, it's a oh, video game. Oh my god. Video game oh, graphics. How we do anything to get it back. <laughs> He's so bad at art. Like, it's really funny. Zuko needs to quit. Like, actually fucking shut up. I'm the Avatar. And this is just the beginning. Church. Oh my gosh, this song from the show! Never mind, it's awesome! Bro, it's definitely not as bad as you guys saying, man. Okay, Joe Biden. It's okay. It's mediocre, I would say. It's not bad. The fact that it's Avatar makes it bad. The problem is that we have something better to compare it to, literally constantly. Like, if this was its own thing and it was of this quality, it'd be fine, I guess. It would be a mid-show that I would skip. Thank you guys for watching. Stay tuned for more Avatar content. Thanks to Aeromir, Alzheimer's is a bad disease, we should cure it, Atomic Leon, Bento, Kane Rivers, Calm Luke, Cosmic Dega, Crystal X Bunny, Frozen Spaghetti, g 3 Om, Gub, Stargazer, Gioni Snare, Yorison, Helio, Hunter Pearson, Hummus, Isaiah Alford, Jace LaRue, K99, Kamui, Lilac Moon, Mirak55, Native5, Omega Waffles by the way, Patrick Case Randolph, Rocky Road with Sprinkles, Sean City Navy Gaming, Tieran Stills, Trinity Martin, Val Explicit, Victoria, Wyatt Lime. Thank you guys so much.